Hey everybody, this is Beauty Holly coming at you right quick with a foundation review slash demo slash first impression. So yeah, and I'm doing it today on two products. I'm doing it on a foundation and I'm also doing it on a foundation primer. So today is my first day using both items. So I'm really excited about that. So let me just show you the first one. The first one is Clinique Stay Matte Oil Free Makeup. And this is in number 24 Golden. So this is what I'm going to be using today or reviewing today. And this basically says it's oil controlling makeup absorbs shine. So, for, so skin looks fresh, flawless all day. Lightweight gel cream formula, formula wears beautifully and comfortably. Or free, perfect for, perfect for all but the driest skins. Perfect for all but the driest skins. So, okay. So this is a cute little box. Again, this is Clinique. And this is what the bottle looks like. And it looks like that. Yeah, so I'm really excited for this. This was like $28, I believe. $28. So. And the primer that I'm going to use today is Laura, Laura Mercier. Mercier. And this is an oil-free uh, foundation primer. And this is what the bottle looks like. It looks like this. This is a, a one full ounce bottle. And the foundation is the foundation is one full ounce as well. The primer states that it's oil free creates the perfect canvas for makeup application, especially for oily skin. This smooth, this soothing, lightweight weather water base gel forms a an even invisible layer that acts as a buffer to outside elements. Um, expertly holding foundation for for longer wear and keeping cosmetic from being absorbed into the skin. Visibly skin smoothing. Vitamin enriched foundation primer oil free is ideal for oily acne prone skin. Yes. And that is definitely me. Okay. So. Let's get started. Okay. So I have wash my face and I have uh, moisturized so I'm going to shake this uh, primer up a little bit I'm going to shake this up and I'm like, oops okay I didn't want to use the, okay but yeah that's what I'm going to use it should be enough this is my first time using these products, so I'm real excited. And you know, I watch a lot of um, women do reviews on certain items. And some like first impressions and some like... Um, um, they like to wear it first and then come back. But... Um, I think I like the first impression even though it may change after a couple of more wears but if my um, thoughts and everything that I stated before is different after a couple more wears of course I will come back and let you know but so far everything has been okay and I think I have come back and you know updated some things on a foundation that I did a first impression on you know so today I am going to use my buffing brush by Real Techniques. I'm going to kind of shake this foundation up. Okay. Has a little seal on it right here. Okay, so here we go. It may be a bit much, but we'll see. I'm just going to tap this on. And 
and it looks like it is a perfect color color match for my skin so I think I'm gonna be happy with that okay I'm going to spray just a tad bit of setting spray on here just to kind of help it um, okay here we go oh yeah this feels really really good going on wow Oh yeah, this feels good. And I would say it's medium to full coverage. Oh yeah, this looks really good and it feels really good going on. It feels very silky. It just feels awesome. And I am loving the coverage and I am loving the color match. Wow. Yeah. What do y'all think? I am really loving this. Y'all excuse my hair. I know it looks a mess. It's fluffy on one side and a mess on the other. I just pulled it back so that I could do this uh, demo for you guys. Oh, yeah. Y'all, I, I, that's one application. That's all I need. This is nice. This is really nice. I love the way it went on. It felt really, really good going on. Smooth, soothing. Yes, soothing going on. It felt silky. I love it. And I love the uh, the color match. And again, I'm in, um, let's see, 24 Golden. This is 24 Golden. Wow. The primer went on. I didn't even talk about the primer. The primer went on kind of, um, it was like a wet feeling kind of kind of wet because it said it has like a gel it's a gel type uh, uh, primer so that's kind of it kind of went on wet but it went on it went right through it went right into my skin and everything so I did I do like the way the primer went into my skin but this foundation <laughs> I am loving this foundation yes I am loving it so let me finish complete my look and I will come back and show you the finish the finished look and we'll get started. Oh, let me go ahead and clock this. It is 1:23. And uh like I said, I'll come back and I'll finish uh with the finished look and we'll see how this foundation holds up. So I'll be right back. Y'all just take a look at it. Let me get closer to y'all so y'all can see. Look at that. That looks really, really nice. I am loving it. Okay. Bye. Okay, y'all. This is the finished look. Again, I am doing a first impression demo. First impression demo and review on two items. Today, I am reviewing the foundation, the Clinique Stay Matte Oil Free Foundation in the color 24 golden see if you can see that there she goes and it's Clinique and here's the bottle and also Laura Mercier Oops, excuse me Laurie Mercier um, Mercier or Mercier Mercier um, foundation primer oil free so I've tried them both on. I explained how they both went on. I am crazy in love with this foundation so far. It went on just spectacular. I loved it. I love the way it felt. I love the way it looks. It's a great color match. I'm surprised I did a good color match because I ordered this off online at Ulta. So I'm very surprised that I 
chose the right color. So um, I clocked this at 123 and I got some errands and stuff that I'm going to do today. And I'll come back in a few hours and let you see what it looks like. I'm going to try to do a final for you. Um, I don't know if I'm going to make it to the final, but I'm going to try to. So, um, But I know I'll be back in a few hours just to show you how it's holding up on me and how well it's... Um, it's going to do. I'm going to say it's going to do good because I am I'm I'm loving this foundation. I really am. I'm loving it. So, yeah, so I'm just going to let you see again what it looks like. And I just really think that it's a great color great color match. I just I love it. I love this foundation so far. Oh, I'm excited. Okay, so I will see I will be back and see y'all in a few hours. Bye. Hey everybody, Beauty Holly back at you. I'm um, checking in. Actually, this may be, it's, well, let me show you the time. It's 5.38 and I believe I clocked at 1.23 so it's been about 5 hours since I've had this makeup on. Um, I am doing a review on the Clinique Stay Matte Oil Free Makeup in color 24 Golden. And um, this is what the bottle looks like. It's one for one full ounce. And I'm also doing a review on the Laura Mercier uh, foundation primer as well. And this bottle is a one point full ounce. Okay, so I've had this on for five hours, and it seems to be doing pretty good. Um, it's a little bit right here on the tip of my nose. I see a little oil trying to break through. But other than that, I'm pretty good. Um, the only thing is, I am going to kind of powder. But it's because my, if y'all can see that, my um, concealer is not in right. So I feel like I need to kind of blend it in a little bit more. I am not an expert at concealers and sometimes I can put too much on and I just don't see how people put all that concealer on and then blend it in and then put the powder on top and it just looks good but when I do it it looks like you can tell that it's not my concealer is not blended in right so I'm not powdering because of the foundation I'm trying to get my concealer mixed in right so hopefully it looks a little bit better anyway I love this foundation. It went on so smooth and so silky and just so soothing. It felt very good going on my skin. It's a perfect color match. I love it. Um, I will buy this foundation again. I will tell you that. Um, I'm going to try to hold out maybe an hour or two just to let you see how it does in the next... Um, Maybe two hours, maybe, what time is it? It's 5.30. So maybe about 6 or 7, I'll try to check back in with you. If not, this could be the final, the final results. But, and just in case it is, just let me tell you that this is a perfect, perfect foundation. I love it. Um, I, I'm hoping that it'll last a couple more hours. Um, I'm at 5 now. I need it to last at least 8 to 9 hours because that's a regular work day for me. And um, I'm hoping that it will last that long. But um, I've eaten. I've been outside. I've ran errands. I've done all that stuff. Grocery shopping. Everything. And so it seems to be holding up really, really well. And the only reason why I powdered earlier was to get my concealer to blend in. My concealer wasn't all the way in. Um, I, didn't, I don't think I powdered my nose or anything. So... Uh, that's okay but yeah it's just a little oil right there on the tip of my nose that's trying to shine through so other than that this makeup is holding up really really well for five hours I'm excited I love it I really love this foundation I do I, this is wow I'm feeling this so yeah so again this could be my final and if it is thank you so much for joining me if not I would try to come back in the next couple of hours just to let you see how it holds up. If not, I'll just type something in the information box and let you know how I held up a couple more hours because I'm not getting ready to take it off. I think I have a couple more things I need to do today. But um, 
yeah thank you so much for spending time with me don't forget to like this video don't forget to share it don't forget to sub if you haven't already um i love y'all and y'all stay awesome bye